We're seeing you take these entrepreneurial steps between working with Redcon 1 and getting involved with gaming. We saw the big AW Games presentation. In your own words, you said you're getting older, which seems like this age is around the prime for a wrestler these days, but everybody's different. We've heard Cody say things like he might want to become a senator. Do you ever have like a set time like, oh, I want to wrap up my career by this time or I want to do this and I'm going to start moving things around to make that happen because you already have a ton of different responsibilities besides the in-ring that people see on Wednesdays. Yeah, I think one of the greatest things I could ever ask for is being able to decide what time that is. It'd be great if I could, but unfortunately, as, as wrestlers and doing what we do, we sometimes don't have the ability to choose. I remember right before we did, you know, you brought up the AJ Styles turn, but earlier on in the year before, I had a very terrible uh, herniation in my neck. And uh, it was the first time I ever had to ask for time off in professional wrestling. I, I'd lost all power in the right side of my body. And... I thought that that was it. I thought that I was going to have to wrap it up and maybe I was already sort of winding down. I was able, luckily enough, to, to turn it around. But, you know, in a heartbeat, these things can just fade and, and or, or they can be taken away from you. So all I'm trying to do is just kind of uh, dip my fingers and toes and as much as I, as, I, as I can. And I'm making sure that all these things that, that I do take on as responsibilities are things that I enjoy outside of wrestling um, so that, you know, there's never a dull moment. So the things that I do in, in the video game world and anime in uh, you know, bodybuilding, fitness, all that stuff, you know, these are interests of mine outside of wrestling. So I'm, I'm keeping busy, but I just want to make sure that if for some reason something happens in the ring or outside of it or whatever, you never know what's going to happen. Um, that, uh, you know, I, I exit without regrets, and now, uh, yeah, I, I I could not put a number on on how long uh, I will be active as a, as a performer. I I don't want to say that I'm going to do it until I just can't physically do it anymore. Yeah. that's a scary thought. <laughs> I think I hopefully I'll just know when it's time. Um, and until. Until it is time, I'd, I'm just going to try to burn the candle on both ends and go out in a blaze of glory rather than just kind of hang out, hang around in a ring too long than I sh like longer than I should. Got to follow the Canadian tradition of Jericho and PCO at this point. Keep it going until your fifties. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it, it would, it's hard to imagine, but um, again, like I said, five years ago, uh, with these supplements, who knows? <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, exactly. There's always there's always advancements. Uh, by by the month, it seems there's something new on on the horizon. So maybe maybe 